Yeah, I'm back with another video. You know, I'm back in this piece. But um, like, share, subscribe. Um, I'm here to talk about Westbrook and the Lakers. Uh, they he just screwed them up, man. Uh, everybody knows when you join LeBron James' team, you're going to go down with the team of the downfall if 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 y'all don't make it to the um play farther in the playoffs or to the finals. It don't matter. You can't win with LeBron James. All the thing the uh, um thing is Westbrook came on to a team that was losing already, that was injured already, and he took now he's taking the downfall for everything that LeBron James fought is. It's his team. He the leader. He don't get no um, criticism. But I'm going to give him this criticism. This is his criticism. He brought Westbrook on the team. He brought Anthony Davis on the team. Before he even came on, on the team, the Lakers was trash. But when he came on the Lakers, they still trash. So... People need to stop saying Westbrook trash. He trash with the Lakers. If he's on another team, I still think he could be an All Star. He he just prosper by himself by through his system how he played. That's how he got got through. When he's in OKC, they play how Westbrook is a duo with him and Kevin Durant. And then later it started being Kevin Durant and James Harden a little bit. Then he left. Then after he left from um after Kevin Durant left, is Westbrook team to itself. And they made it to the playoffs, even though they got bounced, they played through how Russ played. Then after they got Chris, I mean George Paul. I mean George Paul. I mean Paul George. They played through the ball with Westbrook. The reason why it didn't work out, everybody need the ball. And and when you play with LeBron, LeBron want the ball all the time. He want to make um, the plays. He want to score. And he want to be the one that control the offense. So, he... And he already knew when he got Westbrook, he couldn't shoot. They both can't shoot. So, people start need, need to start blaming Westbrook, even though he played trash last year. But he been playing like that the whole time. I guess he was nervous to play on the Lakers, and, and it's hard to play on the team with criticism. Like, they, like the media just keeps saying. He didn't have he didn't have to go through all this criticism to join a big marketing team. All them teams they played on was smart marketing teams. So it's partial LeBron fought and it's partial Westbrook fought. He the one recruited him, him and Anthony Davis recruited him to come on and play on the team. Everybody knows he's not a good three-point shooter. Everybody knows he's not a good shooter. All he he's good at is slashing to the basket. He ain't even the best passer. Not he ain't one of the best passers, but he he used to be a good passer. But he I still think he could be a good player on another team, not with the Lakers. But they trying to kick him out the team by pushing him. To get like all these different point guards like Struder and um, Beverly and Dunn, and now they got the rookie on there. So I guess they're gonna play him as a point. All they doing is trying to put him down, send him down, and trade him. They trying to get offers. They don't want Westbrook. He don't want to be there. They don't want him there. But they ain't going to get no better anyway because it's over for LeBron. It's been over. And everybody, they think he's going to do something. 
They crazy. You need to go check into the mental asylum and go meet your um, crazy people that that's with the crazy people. People, because they not winning. LeBron, he's through. He need to retire. I'm not trying to be a hater. I used to be a LeBron fan. That's that's why I criticize him so much because nobody else, other people do, but they um the the big media people don't. But um that's all I want to talk about. Like, share, subscribe, and I'm out.